Hello, good evening, everybody. Welcome to the class number four. So we're going to, well, to start this. Remember that we finish tomorrow, well, the first unit. La primera unidad la vamos a terminar de mañana, okay? ¿En serio? Hello, sir. Okay. So uh, let's see, here we have Luis, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Well, I'm terrific. Really good. I, what about I you? I am great. Well, that's fine. I am great. Okay. A good Monday or a difficult Monday? Good or difficult Monday? Mm. When lunes or when lunes difficult? <laughs> so, so, moment. So, so. Okay, yes. I don't know why most, most of, of people don't like Mondays. Okay. What about uh, Carito? A good Monday or a difficult Monday? Today was a good Monday. A good really, Monday. Really great. Okay. Relaxing. Nice. Relaxing. Whoa. Well. Yeah. A lot of job. Uh, tired, but I don't know. It it wasn't stressful. Okay. That that's really nice because stress. You can have a lot of work, but not be so stressed. Yes. So that's it. Well, perfect. Really nice. Thank you, Carito. Here we have also Kenya. Hello, Kenya. Good evening. Hello, teacher. So so. So so. Okay. Like an um, intermediate uh, Monday. Okay. Could it be better? Okay. Good one. Oscar. Good evening, my friend. Good night. Good night, teacher. Hello, uh, hello Claudia. Hello, Hello. Good, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Perfect. We are we are more now. And here we have also okay, perfect. Um, we're going to just let me check something because we are just give me a second. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's like weird. Nos han dicho que tengamos otra opción de. No, I prefer white. Definitely. Prefer blank. Okay. So um, we're going to continue with the same topic that is a passive voice, que no lo vimos completamente pues, um, uh, on Friday. But uh, this is vocabulary practice. Vamos a ir con uh, passive voice y con los, algunos adjetivos que ahora eh, lo van a entender pues casi por, por completo. Estoy seguro. So the class number four. And tomorrow we should have finished um, unit one, right? 
para mañana debemos de haber terminado la unidad 1, los homeworks, así que espero que, I hope you can be like finishing, espero que los estén terminando porque eso es súper importante, recuerda que son requisitos, ok, And there it's kind of, well, one of uh, different requirements for you to approve the course, para aprobar el curso, ok, so before we go to the matter, Sí. Eli, hello, welcome back. Hello, teacher. Thank you. Okay, everything, everything okay? Yes. Yes. Okay, yes, because we missed you. Te extrañábamos. We were crying for you. Gracias. Okay, that's nice. I like to to see you again. Okay, and we go now with words. Uh, words which don't have plural, uh, palabras que no tienen plural. We know that we have plurals, for example, book, books, car, cars. Okay, son lo, lo, los sustantivos que son regulares. Y también ten, tenemos los que son irregulares, por ejemplo, mouse, y tenemos mice, mouse, ratón, mice, ratones. Por ejemplo, chill, child, niño, children, niños. Man, Men, ¿verdad? Son irregulares. But in this case, here we have uh, these words, a list of words, information, bread, music, homework, furniture, advice. So you can, you, you can say, well, you can say, but, sí pueden decirlo, but it is not suitable, no es, eh, pues, lo ideal, to say informations, musics, no, you say music, you say information, And in some cases, you can, you can hear it, pueden escucharlo, but it is like very common to say it in singular, okay? I like, I need information. I'll, I have a lot of information. Tengo mucha información. Okay, so that's it. Bread, que es pan. Así se llama un grupo que es muy bueno también, bread. Music, okay? I like different types of music. Me gustan diferentes tipos de música. No, músicas, right? Homework, eh, furniture, que es eh, muebles, todo lo que tiene que ver con, con muebles. And advice es consejo, okay? I need some advice, necesito algunos consejos, pero es advice, así es. Advice se parece a la palabra fish, ¿se recuerdan? Ustedes pueden decir one fish or three fish. No decimos fishes, right? So... Here we have um, this information, bread, music, homework, furniture, furniture, chur, chur, okay? Furniture, advice. And we have some other, some other uh, vocabulary here. Ways to say hurry up. Hurry up is apurate, apresurate, rápido, ya, ya, okay? So come on, chop, chop, step on it, snap it up. There's no time to lose. No hay tiempo que perder. Shake a leg. Let's speed up. Let's go faster. Okay. Come on. Como la canción. Come on. Feel the noise. Come on. Come on. Chop, chop. Uh, here we have step on it. Step on it. Snap it up. Snap it up. Como la T. Después que va una vocal suena como R. Snap it up. Snap it up. Okay. Snap viene de del chasquido. There's no time to lose. There's no time to lose. Shake a leg. Shake es eh, mover, ¿verdad? Agitarse, como shake, 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 cuando están bailando reggaetón. Okay, so let's, let's speed up. Speed up es uh, acelerar. Speed up. Let's go faster. Vamos más rápido. Let's go faster. Okay. So, I like uh, some of them Um, in Spanish we say in español no decimos apresurate ni apurate a veces decimos apurate ya ya books and all those phrases so it's kind of similar okay tell me one that uh, sounds interesting for you Carito you start and then Kenya shake a leg yeah shake a leg Kenya Carlos oh, oh. Okay, Carlos, Eli. Let's go further. 
Faster, porque father es papá. Vamos, papá. No. Sí, sí, faster. Okay. Yeah, faster, nice. Eh, Elisa Rosalina. There's no time to lose. There's no time to lose. Okay, nice. Rosalina, and then Oscar. Activa el micrófono. Activate the microphone. Mm -hmm. Shake a leg. Shake a leg. Okay. Rosalina, um, how do your friends call you? Rosie? Rose? Rose? Lina. 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 N-I-N-A, -N -N -A, Nina. Nina. Okay, Nina. You're going to be Nina. Okay, perfect. Sounds really good for me. Me gustan los nombres cortos. Okay, eh, thanks, Nina. Oscar and Gabriel. There's no time to lose. There's, there's no time to lose. Gabriel, Yvette. Snap your, your, your up. Snap it up. Good. Eh, Yvette, Wilfredo. Let's speed up. Let's speed up. Nice. Wilfredo and Steffi. Chop, chop. Good. Steffi, Luis. Let's go faster. Good. Mm, Luis and Claudia. Come on. Fácil, ¿verdad? Come on. Eh, Claudia, uh, when? Uh, let's go fast, father, faster. <laughs> faster, porque father es papá. Ok, uh -huh. nice. Eh, we go now with Steffi, creo, ¿verdad? O Wendy. <clears throat> ok, Wendy. And then Gabriel. Okay, uh, there's, uh, there's no time to lose. Good. Ok, Gabriel. Gabriel. Eh, Durán, I'm Shake sorry, Durán, Durán. Shake a leg. Ok, perfect. That's it. Okay, maybe you want to say, take notes. I'm going to check the attendance list, okay? So if there is some phrases, I mean, bueno, I personally recommend that you can take notes one, two <clears throat> or three phrases. Yeah. It's not necessary to write them all, but if you do it, it's better. Es mejor si les escriben todas. Y si les escriben todas, Elijan una que a ustedes les gusta. So, in the, in the next or future conversations, you can, you can take them. You can uh, select them and use them. Because that's the point of presenting this vocabulary and information. Ese es el punto, ¿verdad? Que ustedes las utilizan. Start with Alfredo Alexander Saldaña. No, right. Carlos Ramirez. No. Uh, Carlos Abrego. Present teacher. Nice. Uh, Carito. I'm here, teacher. You're there. Uh, Pinto. No. I guess no. Uh, we go with Edwin. Mm, okay, Eli. Hello, Eli. Present teacher. It's perfect. Steffi. Hello. Hello there. Evelyn Ventura. No. Gabriel Beltrán. Hello, teacher. Hello. Se escuchan como explosiones a lo lejos. <laughs> De mi micrófono. Yes, teacher. Ah, yes, es que aquí, teacher. Es que aquí en mi pueblo estamos de, de fiesta. Ahí hubiéramos ido, teacher. teacher. Pues, Estamos, we are on, on like holidays, eh, aquí en Pachimalco, ¿verdad? Acá oh. tenemos familia. Oh. Yes, May. yes uh, it's uh, very interesting. It's like, uh, like there is a, a very common holidays, eh, la fiesta mm -hmm. de las flores y las palmas. It is really, oh, yeah. really interesting. So that's nice. And the, Yo tengo malos it, recuerdos de una fiesta de ahí, de Panchimar. You have bad, bad memories. Bad memories. Why? What happened? Sí, que 
fuimos, le afamaron las piezas a mi abuelita y fuimos, pa. Pero por ahí pasó un accidente, me fregué la columna ese día que fuimos. Y desde Ajá. entonces tengo, de vez en cuando, y tengo los dolorcitos. Dolorcitos, secuelas. I'm so Secuela. sorry, Kenia. I'm so sorry. Sí. Fue ¿Sabes? la primera y última vez que fuimos. ¿Qué sabes por qué fue? Ajá. Viniste y no tomaste chicha. And that's the reason. Ese es el problema that's porque tenía reason. como, quizás, como nueve años. Ah, ok. Entonces, tengo okay, que it, ir a tomar eso entonces. Okay. <laughs> Tal vez se me quita. Definitely, yes. You're going to be cured. Vas a estar curado. Yeah. Ok. Así que no se me asusten por, por esos sonidos. Y aquí tienen <laughs> cohetes de vara. Uh -huh. So that, that's really common. Because at night, from Monday to Friday, they're going to be like very short parties, como pequeñas fe, fe, mm. fiestecitas que se hacen. Mm -hmm. Ok. Uh, nice. Ok. Let's continue with this. Evelyn, no. Gabriel Beltrán. Ah, ya me dijo. I'm sorry. Durán. Durán, Durán. Present. Thank you. Yvette. Present. Nice. Jackie. No, Jackie no, no aparece. Kenia. Present, teacher. Nice. Luis. Hey, hello, teacher. Hello there. Mardo. Mardo sí, is in. Yes. In San Vicente, no, where did you tell me? Se no, me olvida. Hoy no, ya le voy a llamar. Ah, pues es la excusa de Marto. Ok. Eh, Marvin Adonai, no. Mayra Noemi, mm -mm. Oscar. Hello, teacher. Hello there. Nina. Present, teacher. Hello. Wilfredo. Present, teacher. Good. Claudia. Present teacher. Perfect. And Wendy. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you very much, my friends. So it's Monday. Let's um, step on it. Okay. Okay. Here we have this. Sé que ya se los he puesto como tres clases y Kenia dice, teacher, ¿por qué eso? Because we're going to use comparatives. Vamos a utilizar comparativos. We're going to compare people, situations, uh places okay that's it objects if you want so here we have angry and angrier than vamos a utilizar solo la columna the pink column solo la columna rosada how can we do comparative sentences easy for example we can say luis is angrier than wendy Aquí estoy diciendo que Luis es más enojado que Wendy. Obviously, Luis is not angry, but it's an example. So, Luis is angrier than Wendy. ¿Qué necesitamos? We need two uh, people, two places, two situations, or two objects. En este caso tenemos Luis y Wendy. Esa es la clave para hacer los comparativos. Okay. Another comparative. Could it be, let's see. Utilicen cualquiera de esas. If you have some uh, doubt, Tell me for the meaning, okay? Uh, in, in, or you can check it on, on your cell phone, okay? Mm, pero recuerden, esta es la estructura. Carito, can you start, please? And then we go with Kenya. You okay. can, uh, you can, you can mention people, <laughs> or you can say, soy a pango is down San Miguel. Uh, you can say, for example, Spider-Man is down Captain America. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got an example. Uh, for example, my blue car is smaller than my red car. That's perfect. Good one. Mm -hmm. My blue car is smaller than my red car. Mm -hmm. Entonces, tu carro azul es más pequeño que el rojo, right? That's yes, it. it is. Okay, así que así, así es. El BMW más pequeño que el Ferrari. Okay, of course. That usually <laughs> happens. Yeah, why not? Okay. So that. Thank you, Carito. Very nice. Um, Kenya, and then we go with Luis. Okay, teacher. My father, other than my mother. Okay, my father is. Is. Uh huh. Other than. Is older or other? Other is otro. No, older, right? Huh. Older. Ah, okay. My mother. Yes. Quiere decir que tu papá es mayor que tu mamá. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Ahora las cosas han cambiado. But in the past, it was really common that the, uh, the, 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 your father maybe could be like 10 years, 10 years, 15 years older, right? Than, than your mother. That was really common, even 20 years. I have known cases. Yes, well, come on. Ahora le llaman sugar. Okay, uh, who's next? Who's next? Luis. And then we go with Wendy. Okay, teacher, a ver si le comprendí. My, my sister is older than my brother. Yes, perfect. <coughs> okay, uh, Wendy and Claudia. Okay, um, Lisa is more beautiful than Raquel. Ah, I pensé que Bart, Bart Simpson iba a decir, but that's okay, ah, okay, no. yes, Lisa is more beautiful. Estamos utilizando more beautiful porque beautiful tiene más, es, es más exceso, por eso necesitamos el more. Nice, Wendy. Okay, Claudia, and then we go with Oscar. Uh, my sister is um, older than me. Dan. Ah, Dan. 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 Ah, Dan. Thank you. I... Oscar mm -hmm. and then Nina. My... My uncle is, is younger than my father. Excellent. Perfect. Okay, Nina and Wilfredo. Uh, the, the dog is more sweeter than the cat. Okay, uh, the dog is sweeter. Aquí no le agregamos sweeter. more, porque el ER ya es un comparativo, so sweeter. Yes, I agree. And even I prefer dogs, but it's okay. Yeah. There are some cat lovers. There's some yeah. people that will love cat. Okay, uh, Wilfredo and then Gabriel. Uh, Spaniel, I share down English. Okay, Spanish. Spanish. Spanish is a easier than English. Actually, Wilfredo, I may say that English is easier than Spanish. Muy yes, mm -hmm. I consider, yes. And there are a lot of yes. reasons. Uh, mm -hmm. One of the reasons is that in Spanish we have more vocabulary. Just mention how we say perro, different forms to say perro. We say chucho, we say canino, firulais, mm -hmm. okay, el kaiser, and we have a lot of forms. And in English, we have dog, okay? So that is one of the parts. And even in Spanish, we have a lot of idioms, muchas frases idiomáticas, okay? Eh, ponete buxo, um, ojo al Cristo, and there are, there are a lot, a lot. But very nice or sentence. Buena oración, Wilfredo. Eh, Gabriel, and then Eli. Okay, uh, Oscar is happier than Elival. Okay, Oscar is happier than Elivan. Elivan. Who is Elivan? Oscar is happier than Elivan. Than Elivan. Is a, a colleague. Es un compañero. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. okay. Eli and then Duran. The princess Diana more famous than Angelina. Okay. Is the princess. Oh, is, Lady is, D, uh, oh, Princess yeah. Diana is, is more famous. Yes, Princess Diana, the best, <laughs> the, the best. Okay, and here we have also, who was going to say? Duran, and then Carlos. Is my girlfriend more attractive than my friend? Okay, my girlfriend. You say? Yes, uh -huh. yes. My girlfriend, okay. Yo pensé que ibas a decir, <laughs> ibas a usar, I could, I said to X, but perfect, very nice sentence. No, no I like it. I like uh -huh. it. Okay, uh, we go with Carlos and then Edwin. Okay, the Ferrari is faster than my car. Okay, the Caritos Ferrari is faster than your car. Okay, nice, nice. And what about Steffi? Creo que está bailando. Steffi, are you dancing? Ah, no, Edwin. Vamos con Edwin and then Steffi. Okay, Edwin.
Okay, uh, Steffi. Okay, the natural, okay, the natural flowers is more wonderful than artificial. Okay, in ese caso, como okay. the natural flowers are, como está diciendo flores, ajá, entonces are, verdad, porque es plural. Good. Thank you. And Steffi? Okay, okay. Yes, yes. Steffi? The dog is bigger than the cat. Oh, okay. That's it. Good. Now I'm going to say an example with plurals. For example, we can say girls are more sweeter than boys, un ejemplo, un ejemplo, okay? So in this case, because we, we are using plural with girls, es, utilizamos el are, but if we say girl, the girl, la chica, entonces sería plural, sería is. Se dan cuenta que aquí, uh, basically, the main point is to have two objects, objetos, personas, lugares, para comparar. Necesitamos dos para comparar. Very nice sentences. Vaya, ya ves, Kenia, que ya le agarraron el hilo. Hoy sí, ¿verdad? Perfect. Nice. Okay. We have this interesting question. What is the most dangerous thing you have done? Y creo que no van a decirlo todo, ¿verdad? Creo que hay cosas que se van a guardar. And that's nice. If you have done crazy things. Maybe imagine when you were really young, cuando estaban bien jovencitos, I... I can see in your faces that you did a lot of things. Hicieron muchas cosas, se les nota. But just mention one. And for this, maybe we can have volunteers for this. ¿Quién quiere ser el primer voluntario? Carito. Mm, me imagino que tenemos una gran lista, Carito. Right. My teacher tampoco, tampoco. No. No, okay. More or less. Okay. The most, espérenme, déjenme ver para verme mi expresión. Ok. Ok, the most dangerous things I've done in life was once when I was in college, college, college. and we college and we asked for a ride on the highway and apparently the guy who pick up, pick it up, up had drugs. Because he acted super strange and when the friend in the other car looked sign for him, he panicked and came back and made us take him to the police station to look for him. It was a horrible scare. Wow, that's a very stressful tense because right. of that. Because you could be included in, 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 in that, well, in, in that crime, because it is it's a crime. Of course, the, the idea of the, the, the man was, oh, I, I carry at people, university students, so. The so the police is not going to say, to, to tell me anything. To but the police stuff, I, I finish in jail. You, wow. Okay. Of course, all of the car, all the students are. Oh. The, the guy with the drug. And, and how many nights? One night, two nights, or more than that? In jail? No, I, I don't know. Hours? I don't know. No. Years. Okay. In Colombia, if the police uh, te atrapa, catch you with drugs, Ca it's uh, five years, seven years. 10 years. Just for having drugs. Solo por tener las drogas. You are taking to jail sí, for years. nosotros que andamos de, de, de jalón, de, de aventón. Right. Uh -huh. Como decimos nosotros. Uh -huh. The right. right. Okay. Pero nosotros decimos right. Right. Decimos. right. But it's right. Give me a right. Okay, Carito. But you were not in jail, right? You? No, no, no. no. Absolutely not. But... Perfect. O sea, no era la manera como actuaba el tipo. Yo estoy segura que el tipo llevaba drogas y nos recogió para eh, evitar. Eh, el yes. Okay. Yes. You were like, uh, yeah. You were ju just the. Pantalla. The pantalla. Yes. You're like, like, like for the smoke. Okay. Yes. So that's it. Wow, Carito. Eh, you were close. Imagine, 
imagine that man could have been said that, oh, no, but she is my girlfriend or she is part of, of this. And you can be included in that. We are like, uh, like three or four students. Okay, yes. Wow, imagine. Te pudieron haber incluido en eso. To be included in that. Well, Karit, very nice. Sure. Lo bueno que ya dejaste esa vida, Karit. Good. <laughs> no, kidding. No, kidding. Very, very nice. Uh, imagine now you can you have stories to tell your grandkids. Ya tienes historias para decir a tus nietos, right? So that's it. Bad someday, experience. someday. Yes, yeah. bad experience, definitely. Okay, thank you, Carito. Okay, and now we are going to listen. Luis, are you ready? And then Oscar. Teacher, yo creo que entendí mal la pregunta porque yo lo relacioné más que todo al trabajo. No problem, yes, no. it's okay, it's okay. Okay, es algo que me pasó en, oh, en mi trabajo. Definitely, go ahead. Okay. Uh, once I was about to delete the accounting of our entire exercise and had not done a backup, even the dream left me that time. Uh, una vez. Wow. Ajá. Eh, casi se me borra todo mi ejercicio contable desde enero yes. hasta diciembre no y no, y no tenías no tenía la, la cómo se llama el, el respaldo right no. wow <risa> so a lot of work close to, to be like lost para estar casi yes. lo punto de perderlo sí así wow. es but at the yes. end you were okay at the end yes. you were okay yes. Yes, you were mm -hmm. so close to fail. Ya yeah, ibas a fallar. Close to fail. Sí. So mm -hmm. now, now you have like, a, you learned your lesson. La aprendiste tu lección, right? Now you yes. have to be saving and have a backup of everything. Definitely. Even yes. you can trust USB device. No puedes confiar tampoco solo en las USBs. You can have another copy of your things, right? Mm -hmm. yes. Okay, so that's it. Okay. Oh, mm -hmm. good. Well, you were close okay. too. And what about Oscar? If Oscar is ready, and then Kenya. What is the most dangerous thing I have ever done? Uh, when I have a, a stage I need life, where uh, I many dangerous things that I don't know, to talk about. I would, uh, I, but then good, I have the opportunity to change my life. Oh, yes. Good, Oscar. Remember that everybody deserves, everybody deserves a second chance, another yes. opportunity. We make yes, mistakes. Yeah. Yes, and that's it. Yeah. And we, we make mistakes all the time, right? But yeah. we have to improve. Okay, good, Oscar. Thank you. Uh, what about Kenya and then Wendy? Okay, teacher. Yo no fui tan tremenda chiquita. We are not saying. No. Solo voy a hacer. Como... Ah, tremenda, ¿cómo? ¿Cómo? Ya de grande es tremenda. Uh -huh. No. Ya <laughs> Ya mayor les agarra. Ya mayor me agarra otro. Yo. Pero no he pasado así gran experiencia. Vale, lo mío es dul la vector la vectori o es la vectoti. ¿Cómo se dice laboratorio, teacher? Laboratory, laboratory, okay. laboratory. Do laboratory with different types of hazardous chemical. Oh, really? Uh -huh. And what happened there? There was an explosion or something like that, or a mix. Uh, sí. Toxic. Me, mix. Ajá, una vez casi me intoxico cuando estaba en clases. Ah, pero eso, intoxicación, yeah, that's common, right? Y de ahí, ajá, y de ahí me iba a caer también ácido sulfúrico en la mano. Oh, wow. Yes. So those components are so dangerous because your skin or Yes, any part of, of your body can be hurt. Pueden estar dañados, okay? Or burned. So that's it. No, that's really dangerous if you don't take uh, take care of, of the things you're doing, okay? But at the end, no problem, right, Kenya? Yeah. Okay, good. Yes, you were kind of close to, to fail. 
Okay. Uh, now let's go with Wendy and Claudia. Okay. Uh, the most dangerous thing I've done so far was rappelling down the Huayua waterfall. I went down a uh, 13 meters waterfall. I was scared to death, but I had already paid. And, uh, <laughs> and I took a risk. It was a worry. Yes, rappelling. Es escalar, right? Es bajar. Yes. In waterfalls, cascadas, waterfall in Huayua, mm -hmm. say. Yes. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I, there are a lot of waterfalls. I love that place. Las Canteras, I guess is the name, right? Canteras. Es, no. Is the, it's another. It's the other. It's the Siete Cascadas. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. It's the name of Huayua. Uh -huh. Okay. Siete Cascadas. Yes, you have already paid. Ya habías pagado. So, anyway, <laughs> you had to do it. Okay? Yes. Not to waste, not to waste, para no desperdiciar, not to waste money, right? Okay. okay. Nice. Uh, we go with Claudia and then Edwin. Quiero ver a dangerous thing you have done. Uh, I was five years old and I loved and match uh, almost on pair with the gas drum. <laughs> oh, really? But nothing worse? Yes. No pasó algo, algo peor? No, not, not. Okay. Es, uh -huh. No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yes, yeah, sometimes when we are kids, uh, we are... Yes. That usually happens that we fell down, we, we hit our head, our body, so that's, and that's dangerous. Really uh, curiosity. Yes. Mm -hmm. Curiosity. That's it. Okay. Curiosity. Okay. Thank you, uh, Claudia. And uh, we go with Edwin. Okay, Edwin. Okay. The, the most dangerous thing I have done is to jump from a height of 15 meters into a pool. It was terrifying, but uh, in the end, the feeling was rewarding. Okay, in a pool, piscina, it was a pool? No. 15 meters, right? Uh, no, uh, meters? Uh, sí, uh, como una, una, una poza. Como río, river. Ah, okay. Yes, yes. And how deep, que tan profundo como la canción, how deep is that river or in that case, uh, that, that, that. Eh, como do, tres metros. Okay. Well, kind of dangerous because if you uh, fell down, to, the guy, oh, jumped into 15 meters, imagine. Well, you could be harder. Puedes haberte lastimado. Okay. So that's it. But the adrenaline is like very high. Because very I mean, high. Be, be, be pasar los En unos minutos todo. Toda tu vida. Todo, todo tu vida. Mi vida. <laughs> ok, that's it. Te sentiste vivo. You felt really alive after that. Sentiste que si estaba sí, muerto, sí, para ahí claro. reviviste. Ok. Claro. <laughs> ok, perfect. That's nice. And we continue later with, with you, uh, with the rest. So remember, uh, college. College es, pues, no es colegio, sino que ya es universidad, ya es un nivel académico un poquito más. más. Más alto, jail, prisión. Imagínense lo que tenemos aquí en los opuestos. College, jail. We have catch, uh, que es atrapar. Por eso nosotros, we say cachar. Cachá esto o acachá esto. So that's catch. Uh, so it's part of the, the words that we use. Um, then here we have um, ride. When we say, give me a ride, dame un aventón. Ride es montarse o subirse. Okay, so ride a bike, subirse una bicicleta, montar bicicleta, motorcycle. So in this case, give me a ride con D. Pero decimos ride, como ride max. Decimos, no, it's a ride in D. And once significa una vez. Once, when you're talking, uh, maybe you are explaining an anecdote or a story, you are telling a story, you say, okay, uh, once when I was 10 years old, I was playing with my cousin, blah, blah, blah. Backup and respaldo. 
deserves, eh, deserve es merecer, deserves con tercera persona. Deserve, me, merecer. I deserve love, the same love that I give. So, an example. So, merecemos amor. Hurt, lastimar. Eh, waste, desperdiciar. Curiosity, curiosidad. How deep, cuán profundo o qué tan profundo. Okay. Recuerden que con el how podemos utilizarlo de diferentes maneras. How big, qué tan grande. Eh, how, how long, qué tan, qué tan largo, qué tan grande. How long, how, what? How big, how deep, how long. Can say how, how, many, how, how many, how much. El how es, se parece un poquito al get. El get se puede utilizar con un montón de palabras. And how similar. So, thank you. That's it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perfect, my friends. We have more vocabulary. And thank you for all your, your answers. Really nice. Interesantes. Ya veo que ha sido bien tranquilito. Entonces, because you have been tremendous. Ha sido tremendo. Usted, hay cosas que no nos no están contando. Well, we have this conversation mm, and, okay, here we have this. And let's check this. We have, what is reputation? How do businesses build their reputation? What is the reputation of the place you work? We all have, we all have, Ex colleagues with bad reputation, ex bosses with bad reputation. Siempre tenemos compañeros, ex compañeros de trabajo o ex jefes, ex jefas with bad reputation because they are not good professionals, right? And on the contrary, we have also good employees, good bosses, good uh, managers. So that's it. And here we have um, discuss and write about the reputation of your company. Well, uh, we can say, mm, my company has a really good reputation or my company has like a difficult reputation, not so good. Okay, uh, we're not going to talk about, we're not going to talk about bad things of your company. Okay, so relax. But we have positive things in our company and negative things. So that's part of reputation, positive or negative comments. Okay, But let's uh, go to this conversation. Here we have Daniel and Jessica, okay? Y como son tan, tan, ¿cómo se llama? Tan, no, intelligent, you are so intelligent, but I mean, perceive, te perciben bastante. Tell me one word that you remember. Elisa and Carito. One word from the conversation. Elisa, no. No, solo El Salvador, no te. El Salvador, well, actually, that's a word, es una palabra. Carito en Wilfredo. Congratulations. Ok. Eh, Wilfredo, Gabriel. No. No. Ok. Gabriel en Claudia. No, teacher, no. No, come on, Gabriel. Okay. Claudia and Kenya. Ah, well, uh, company. <laughs> company, nice. No, Se company. la está inventando, pero está bueno. Me gusta. I like it. I like no, it. No. Ah, okay. <laughs> no, I like it. No. Good, Claudia. And we go with uh, who was Kenya and Wendy. Are you happy world? Oh. Okay. okay. Nice. Wendy and Luis. And Raden. Okay. And Prestigious. Prestigious. Okay. Perfect. Luis, what about you? Yo no sé si es invento, teacher, pero yo también vi company. Viste que. Okay, <laughs> nice. Good. Sí. Thank you. Thank you. Nice. Nice. <laughs> no, what's like inventing? You are so creative. Okay. What about to. I'm going to ask Carlos. Carlos. What are the names of the people in the conversation? Pero Daniel, me acuerdo. Daniel, okay. And what about the girl? 
Ah. Ajá, Carito. Jessica. Yes, Jessica Simpson. Yes, here we have, and also we have, well, Daniel and Jessica. So, Jessica, what does your company do? Obviamente, tenemos el does porque estamos hablando de la tercera persona, que es la compañía. La compañía es una cosa. So, what does your company do? At Rex, we produce clothes for kids. You can say at Simán, at Curacao, at whatever. En, ¿verdad? En el nombre de la empresa que es Rex, we produce clothes for kids. I see. And what is Rex known for? Este known es un pasado participio. ¿Y cómo es eh, conocido? ¿O por qué es conocido Rex? Rex is known, aquí utilizamos ya eh, la, lo de las, el, la voz pasiva. Eh, Rex is known for the modern designs. Designs, not the things. And the quality of the clothes we make. Great. And are you happy to work for Rex? It's a good question for all of you. Are you happy to work for your company? You can say, mm, yes, teacher. And you can say, mm, sometimes, just the day they pay, so el día que pagan, well, well. Y aquí tenemos esta palabra que ya la conocen. Absolutely, right? Creo que nunca se le va a olvidar eso. Rex is recognized. No, re, re, recognized. Y miren, tiene ed. As very prestigious, prestigious company. Their personnel is important for them. Congratulations, Jessica. You are right. Rex is rated as one of the 10 most prestigious companies in El Salvador. Felicidades, Jessica. Eh, tienes razón, ¿verdad? Rex está como, pues, en, está, right, está en el top. ¿Verdad? Está asociado, ¿verdad? Está, pues, eh, digamos, en el rating de eh, las 10 compañías más prestigiosas en el mundo. So, maybe your company is a prestigious one or maybe not. Okay, so that's it. And so, remember, known, designs, absolutely, recognized, prestigious, prestigious, rated, rated. O sea, rated, pero como la T suena como R, rated. Okay, so that's it. I will need you to have uh, some screenshots. Maybe, Carito, can you help us, please, please? Ahora mismo, teacher, right now. Right here, right now. Okay, it's ready. Perfect. Thank you, Carito. Okay, we're having. Um, The groups. Teacher. Yep. ¿Cómo se pronuncia glutes o glutes? Mm. En, el, en el segundo párrafo de Jessica. De... Clothes. 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 Sí, sin la E. Ok, gracias. Así. Pero sería clow. Mm -hmm. Clothes. Clothes. Yes, clothes we make. Es la ropa que hace, ¿verdad? Porque es ropa para, para, para niños. Ok. Uh, any other uh, difficult word or new words? Alguna palabra que, que también les, les parezca como extraña. Ok. Recognized. Recognized. Ok. We're having a practice. Please, I need you to check it. Revisen la conversación antes de que lo... lo los, Agrega los grupos y me van a aceptar la solicitud, the request. ¿Hay alguna revisada ahorita la conversación, please?
Okay, see you. Ok, Nina, necesito que aceptes, igual Edwin. Necesito, I need you to accept. Hello. Hello. Everything okay? Nina? Are know. you there? ¿Qué pasó, Carito? Te dio calor. You work with it's, a jacket. A really nice jacket. I like it. It is it isn't a jacket, it's a blue I don't know. Ah, okay. Shirt. Shirt. A very yes. casual shirt. Okay, pretty nice. Yes. Pretty, but it's really hot. Yes, especially uh, well, um, at night it's kind of hot sometimes. So uh, we have to use air conditioner or fan, right? That I can happen. use that because I have sinusitis. You are, so um, you you are, you are allergic to, to the that wind, the, the dust. Yes. You know. Have you treated that? Yes, that um, I, I, I no. <laughs> No, okay, you should. <laughs> Maybe you can be cured 100%, quizá no se te puede curar 100%, but you can have like a, 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 a better quality of life because sometimes it is difficult to breathe. I have I have like rhinitis, tengo rhinitis también, and it's oh, really? some, sometimes I just uh, can breathe only with one, one part of my nose, solo con una parte puedo that happens to me all the time. Besides, I have my tabique. Mi tabique ah, está desviado. Really. Un desastre total. Y no puedo abrir la ventana porque se entran los cucarrones. Yes, that's another. Mm -hmm. yes, yes, that's a, that's another um, aspect. Okay. So well, actually, Carito, let's practice. Okay, because Nina is not here, unfortunately. Okay. <clears throat> Okay. So, Jessica, what does your company do? At Rex, we produce clothes for kids. I see. And what is Rex known for? Rex is known for the modern design and the quality of the clothes we make. Great. And are you happy to work for the for Rex? Absolutely. Red is recognized as a very prestigious company. Their personnel is important for them. Congratulations, Jessica. You're right. Rex is rated as one of the 10 most prestigious companies in El Salvador. Okay, now you're done, Daniel. I am Jessica. Okay, so Jessica, what does your company do? At Rex, we produce clothes for kids. I see. And what is Rex known for? Rex is known for the modern designs and the quality of the clothes we make. Great. And are you happy to work for Rex? Absolutely. Rex is recognized as a very prestigious company. Their personnel is important for them. Congratulations, Jessica. You're right. Rex is rated as one of the 10 most prestigious companies in El Salvador. Perfect. 
Carito, siento que has mejorado mucho desde el curso pasado. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, I love it, I like it. Ya venías con una buena base, but you're going. I like mm -hmm. it. Okay. Nina. He hello, profe. Excuse me. No problem. I, I have a low battery and then I have you some problem with the, the device. connection. No problem. Excuse me. Okay, maybe you, you can practice a little bit, okay? Okay. Okay, my friends, volunteers for practicing this. I need a couple. Necesito una pareja. ¿Quién se anima? ¿Mm? Carito dice que viene con todo, con Nina. ¿Es it? Yes, of course. Y Elisa también dice, no se le queda atrás, <laughs> le va a ganar. Okay, so, go okay, ahead, Carito. Nina. Are you Daniel or Jessica? Da Daniel, it's okay. 
So, Jessica, what does your company do? At Rex, we produce clothes for kids. I see. And what is Rex known for? Rex is known for the modern design and the quality of the clothes we make. Great. And are you happy to work for Rex? Absolutely. Rex is recognized as a very prestigious company. They personally is important for them. Congratulations, Jessica. You're right. Rex is rated as one of the 10 most prestigious companies in El Salvador. Perfect. Really nice. Okay. Very good. Now, thank you. Uh, Ellie and company. Gabriel. Okay. Show time. Gabriel. Gabriel. Uyo. Uyo. Iran. Gabriel Beltran, right? Ernesto. Durán. Yeah, no, yo. Durán. Okay, Durán. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Okay. So, Jessica, what does your company do? At Rex, we produce clothes for kids. I see. And what do Rex can afford? Rex, in for the modern design in the quality of the clothes we make. Great. And are you happy to work for Rex? Actually, Rex in Recognize is a very prestigious company. The personnel is importing. Congratulations, Jessica. You right, Rex is rated as one of the 10 most prestigious companies in El Salvador. Okay, thank you. Very nice. Really good pronunciation. Solo vamos a tomar aquí eh, esa palabra. Congratulations con S. Okay, congratulations. Eh, como les había dicho, congratulations. Normal, normalmente le quitamos la S o las consonantes de último. Okay, so that's congratulations. They now okay. recognize. Oh, no. Very good. Really nice. Vamos mejorando. I like it. Thank you, okay. Okay. Good, my friends. Now let's continue. Here we have this. Um, say if the statements are true or false. Vamos a decir si son verdaderos o no. ¿verdad? Verdadero o falso. True or false. Ok. Verdadero como, como el amor y falso como los préstamos. Ok. So here we have four sentences, cuatro oraciones. And you have to read it. One by one and say true or false. Pulse. Okay, so volunteers for this because I have some, I have in, in mind some names, but you tell me. Okay, uh, Wendy and Nina. Okay, and Oscar and Ellie. Good. Okay, Wendy, pick one from one to four. Uh, one. Okay. Um, people now read both clothes. With modern design for kids, is true. Definitely true. Okay, produces, produces. Produce, produces. <laughs> produces. Very nice, Wendy. Okay, here we have Nina and then Oscar. Okay, people now, Rex manufactures quality clothes for kids. Hmm? I think it's true. Yes, definitely. It's true. And here we have Oscar and Ellie. Okay, Oscar. Number four. Oh, number four. People raise Rex as one of the 20 most prestigious company in the El Salvador is Paul. That's false, definitely. Okay. That's, but we can say bingo. Mm -hmm. And Ellie, number three, right? Uh, two. Okay, can you read it, please? People, C-Rex. Uh, number C-Rex, a prestigious company. Mm -hmm. Yes, so it's true, as you say. So it's true. Yes, that's it, it's true. Okay, now here we have this, pero principalmente, vamos a ver eso, dice, contrast the sentences in bold from the dialogue in exercise two, the sentence, and the sentences in three. Okay, uh, Carito, can you read this part, which sentences? Carito. I'm sorry, did you what? Can you read it, please? Okay. Emphasize, emphasize. Okay. Which sentences emphasize the doors of the action? No, recognize 
Ok, ajá, the doers, o sea, los que hacen la acción. Which sentences emphasize, ok? ¿Cuáles oraciones son las que enfatizan eso, ok? And here we have this. Um, ¿Qué verbos podrías ver uh, las que, 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 que genera una acción? Vamos a ver acá. Tenemos uno en específico. Read it. I'm sorry. And produce. Which one? Uh, you were saying another, right? Produce. Okay, produce is one. Mm -hmm. That's it. And what is the other that you mentioned? Uh, or... I say great. Right. But okay. I don't know. Great. Yes. Luis? Right. No, pero quizás no entra to work. To work. To work. Mm -hmm. mm, casi, casi. Solo que aquí mm -hmm. dice we're happy. Esto es un. Eh, Infinitivo. Cuando... Infinitivo. Se recuerda con el to. Mm -hmm. Pero es un verbo de acción. Yes, Luis. But in this case, maybe it is not an action. No es una acción, ¿verdad? Entonces, ahorita vamos a ver lo de la voz pasiva. Que no es tan difícil, ya van a ver. Ok, but thank you, Carito and Luis. And here we have this. Um, Kenia, can you help me with this? The second sentence. Which sentence? Which sentence em emphasize, emphasize. emphasize the action to be known, known for mm -hmm. to be recon recognized, recognized. Mm -hmm. recognized as to be read, read as. Yes, that's it. Entonces aquí tenemos las otras, ¿verdad? Known for, okay, recognized. <coughs> Ok, entonces okay. tenemos que aquí es reconocido. Es, eh, y Rex is known. Ok, that's it. And vamos a ver lo siguiente. Um, can you help us, Claudia? Reading this. Que esa es la clave del éxito. Ok, Claudia. Use. Use, use the passive voice to um, emphasize. emphasize. I emphasize that the actions are more important than the those subject. Doers, mm -hmm. subjects. Doers, ah. Okay, we emphasize. Doers. Entonces, nos vamos a enfocar en esto, miren. And our, um, actions, las acciones son los importantes, no el sujeto, ahorita, in this case, okay? Thank you. And here we have, um, Luis. I'm sorry, teacher, what did you say? That it means doers. Eh, doers. Doer, by, do es hacer. Entonces, Doer. doers son los que hacen. Lo, 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 los ejecutores. Okay. For example, you can say, um, the mechanic painted the car. El mecánico pintó el carro. O you can say, ahí estás enfo enfocando en que el mecánico lo hizo. Pero si tú dices, the car is painted in black. Ah, el carro se pintó de negro. No, estamos, no, no le ponemos atención a quién lo hizo, si fue el mecánico. Solo queremos saber que el, el carro está pintado. Ok, so that's it. So, eh, nos enfocamos en la acción, pintar. El carro se pintó, no la persona que lo hizo. Ok, but uh, um, we're going to have some examples. Ok, Luis. Eh, teacher, look at the examples and complete the statement below. Ajá, continua. Rex is. Rex is a re, recognized. A recognized and a prestigious. prestigious Continue. Rex is Rex rated. Is rated in, in, as one of the 10 most prestigious company. Hmm, that's it. Entonces dice que, thank you. Rex es, es reconocido como una compañía prestigiosa. ¿Por quién es reconocido? ¿Quiénes lo reconocieron? Mm -mm. It doesn't matter. No importa. Lo que importa es que es reconocido. Now, Rex is rated. Rex es eh, clasificada o está ubicada como una de las 10 eh, compañías más prestigiosas. ¿Quién la ubicó ahí? ¿Quién dijo eso? It doesn't matter. No importa. Mm -hmm. Importa que esté ubicada ahí. Mm -hmm. So that's, that, that's the, the emphasizing here. So here we have, um, for this, I will need Edwin. Can you help us, Edwin, reading to say a sentence? Okay. 
Okay. To say a sentence, the passive voice use the verb to be following be the by the mm -hmm. present participle. Okay. Past participle of the main verb. Thank you, Edwin. Ahora le voy a mostrar algo. <laughs> Quiero, I need you to see, vean esto. Ya le voy a preguntar. No copien, solo sigan su corazón. Follow your heart, that's all you need. <laughs> okay, so let's ask to Gabriel Beltran. What did you see? ¿Qué viste? Try, fall, fail. Good. Thank you. Yvette, what did you see? ¿Qué viste, Yvette? Uh, clap. O sea, vi más, pero no me acuerdo de las otras. No problem. Clap. Así. Okay, thank you. Okay. Nice. Uh, we have Carlos. What did you see? Solo drive. Okay, drive. Mm, bien. Uh, ¿Se recuerdan que estaba en la parte de arriba de las columnas? Los títulos. Uh -huh. ¿Qué decía? Mm -hmm. Volunteers. En lo que yo vi, decía present. Yes. Present. Ajá. What else? Regular, regular mm -hmm. verbs y regular verbs. Yes, regular and irregular. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Nice, good. Past. Past. Present y. Present past participle. And past participle. participle. Really good. Really nice. Ok, bien, ya veo que se fijan. Tener cuidado si me ven en la calle, se van a fijar mucho. Ok, so here we have uh, this. And this is a list of regular and irregular verbs. Teachers, pero eso, los verbos regular y irregular. Relax. Down. Ok. Veamos acá. Regular verbs, que son los verbos que nos gustan a todos, because they are easy. They are very simple, right? Definitely. Ok, so here we have this. Ok. Los verbos regulares se dividen en tres, igual que los irregulares. Ok. Basic. The verbs are divided in two. Los verbos se dividen en dos. Regulares y los irregulares. Los buenos y los malos. Los fieles y los infieles. Now, in talking about regulars, hablando de los regulares, tenemos una subdivisión. Present, past, and past participle. Y eso lo tenemos en español también. Por ejemplo, uh, tenemos aquí, boil, hervir. Boiled es hervía o hirvió. Y el pasado participio es hervido. Hervido. Casi todo participio en español termina en ado, ido o edo. Ado, ido o edo. Ok. Por eh, ejemplo, tenemos dance, bailar. Danced, bailó. And danced sería Luis, ¿qué sería danced? Eh, ado, edo, ido. No bailado. Bailado, bailado. Bailado, bailado. That's it, thank you. Ok. Eh, no, vamos a poner another, another one by the dust. Hate. Sé que ustedes lloran hate. No odian. Son muy puros de corazón. Hate, odiar. Hated, odiaba. Y ese hated de acá es. Odiado. Odiado. No, si sí. mi jefe ha sido el más odiado de todos. My boss has been the most hated in the enterprise. Ok. I have danced. He bailado. I have danced for three hours. He bailado. Sandungueado por tres horas. Ok. The water uh, boiled or the water has been boiled for 20 minutes. El agua está hirviendo por 20 minutos y los frijoles se les quemaron. So, ado, edo, ido. Esa es eh, la terminación de las palabras en español. Ok. Presente, pasado, pasado, participio. Y es, Carito. Teacher, pero el, el pas participio. Va acompañado del hat. Mm -hmm. Normalmente. Normalmente. Para 
Okay. Sí, porque los dos se escriben igual. ¿Cómo hago para saber? ¿Cuál, tenés que seguir algo. ¿Qué tenés Jeffrey? que seguir? I have dancer. Como el futuro, teacher. No, el futuro está en tu corazón, Kenia. Tranquila. Aquí. Como el sentido de la oración. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Vaya, para el futuro, Kenia, utilizamos will o going to. Si ¿sí se recuerdan, ¿verdad? O oh, incluso ING. Pero en este Ajá. caso, en este caso, sí, me imagino que lo que dice Kenia es que si utilizamos un auxiliar. Ajá, aquí está. Ajá, ajá. Muy bien. Sí, y ese sentido de la oración, como dice Ivette, ¿verdad? Que entonces, esto es el... Para que le pongan sabor. Ok. So, um, in this case, here we have a present... Yo también puedo Present perfect, el presente perfecto. Pero ahorita no vamos a ver el presente perfecto. O sea que esto... Olvidémonos de esto. So, lo único que va a ser importante es este verbo. Ahora, me dice Carito, pero ¿cómo lo voy a diferenciar? Ajá. Esa es la gran duda, teacher. Teacher, sería... Ajá. Uh -huh. Normalmente, cuando utilizamos el pasado simple, acá solo utilizamos un adverbio. Ayer, yo bailé ayer. Pero acá yo he bailado cuatro horas con mi ex. Uh, ok. So, in this case, están haciendo énfasis en que han estado bailando cuatro horas. En cambio, ah, bailé ayer. Oh, claro, ejemplo, acá están dando detalles. Y aquí, ah, ya pasó eso. Ya se me olvidó. Ni recuerdo con quién bailé. Ok. Pero no nos vamos a meter en esto. Lo que yo necesito es que el past participle lo veamos. Ok. Nice. Ahora, eh, vamos con el siguiente. Um, vamos con. I'm sorry. I don't know where I'm going to ask you guys to read That's it. Irregular verbs. Vámonos. Let's go to the, the opposite side. Vamos al lado opos, op, opuesto. Si ven, ven las letras, o oh, las ven muy pequeñas, las letras. ¿Las ven pequeñas? Ok. Muy pequeño, teacher. Ok, I'm sorry. Es que en lo pequeño está el sabor, hombre. Está más concentrado. Ah. <laughs> uh. Sí, pero es que okay. ellos y medio ciego. Cri, cri, cri. <laughs> Mal excusa. Son, son malos. Okay, irregular, <laughs> irregular verbs. Okay. So here we have also present, past, and past participle. Okay. Ahora, el verbo, si se dan cuenta, por ejemplo, en dance, el pasado. Y el pasado participio es igual. Dance, dance. Entonces, ¿cómo lo vamos a saber? Ahorita solo nos vamos a enfocar en el pasado participio. Eso es lo importante en sus vidas. No importa nada más ahorita. El pasado participio, ¿ok? Porque hay otras estructuras gramáticas, pero solo nos vamos a enfocar en el pasado participio. Participio. Past participle. Past participle. Ahora. Past participle. Pull, pull. Como people. Participle. Okay, so in this case, here we have dance, dance, dance. Okay, pero en este caso, acá tenemos los verbos irregulares and they are kind of different because in present is in one way, in the past, simple past is another way, in past participle, sometimes it's another way, es otra manera. Ejemplo, comer. Comer. Comí. Aquí sería Com comer. Comido. Comado. No. O comió. Entonces, comido. No, comió es este, el pasado. De. ¿Ok? Comido. Pasado, pero comido. comido. Recuerdan, ado, ido, edo, ido. Es comido. Comido. Ado, es edo, comido. ido. Comido. Es como comido. Quien, presente, eh, quien presente es ar, er, ir. Eh, caminar, bailar, sonreír, dormir, ¿verdad? Eh, en cambio, en pasado a principios, ado, edo, ido. Siempre pensemos eso, ado, edo, ido. Ok. Eh, entonces, acá eh, tenemos otro, por ejemplo. Drink. Drink. Tomar chicha. Ok, drink chicha. Ok, here we have drink. I drink every Saturday. Tomo, I drink water. No, I, I drink chocolate every Saturday, toma chocolate todos los sábados. I drank a lot of 
chaparro yesterday. Tomé mucho chaparro ayer. And I have drunk, I have drunk milk since childhood. He bebido eh, leche desde, desde que era niño, desde la niñez. Ok, ahora tenemos, miren qué verbo tenemos acá. Do. 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 Tenemos did. Tú hacer. Did hacía, hacía, hicimos. Y aquí, ha, ha sido, será ha sido. Hecho. Hicieron. Hecho. 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 Es como el, el roto, ¿verdad? No decimos rompido, ¿verdad? Decimos roto. ¿Qué otro verbo que tenemos así? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eh, y así te, te, tenemos verbos que, que son excepciones, pero así es. Ok. Ahora, ya que vimos eso, now that we have said regular and irregular, vamos a lo que más nos importa. El otro es muerto, teacher. Muerto. Ah, morido. Yes. Thank you, <risa> I have, sí, me he morido. Ajá. Ajá. Sleep, teacher. No. Sleep. Eh, sleep. Dormido. No va. No, casi. Sí, pues, sí. Todos nos queremos dormir, Claudia. Tranquila. Si todos queremos. I'm sorry. Estoy de acuerdo. Ok, pero casi. Ok. Entonces, no matter what, no importa que regular e irregular, ahorita lo que nos interesa son past participle. Participle. O pueden decir participle. Participle o participle. Depende de ustedes. Ok. Nos vamos a enfocar en regular e irregular. No vamos a decir, ah, el past es este, el presente. Mm -mm. Past participle. Ok. So, eh, en este caso. Como les había dicho, eh, sometimes regular verbs are easy because we add ed, agregamos ed. But irregulars we have to memorize. Tenemos que guayabiarlo. Ok, memorize. Tenemos que memorizarlos. That's it. Pero algunos son fáciles. Yeah. Now, dígame algún past participle que se recuerden. Busquen en sus corazones. Kenya, you are the first. One past participle. De iba Steffi, que ya nos apareció con todo. Ya no está bailando. Kenia, one past participle, cualquier pasado participio, regular o irregular. Cualquiera, yes. mm, Fake o fake, algo así, me acuerdo que era una palabra. Me gusta que te estás inventando palabras. Kenia. Es que algo así era feed o fake. Ah, fed, fed, fed. Ajá. Uh -huh. No, bye, yes. Mira, inventando, inventando. No, llegaste. teacher, yo no estoy inventando. Yo me acordaba que era Fido Fred. Ok, perfect. F, E, D. Yes, Fed, Fed, perfect. Ok, we go now with Steffi and then Luis. Carito, no estoy viendo la captura. Dance. Ah, dance. Not ah, quieren, quieren. Carito, yo confío en ti, confío en ti. Uh, Luis, and then Edwin. Brushed. Brushed. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, Edwin and... No, Wendy and Edwin. Accepted. Okay. Edwin, Yvette. Uh, phone. Mm -hmm. mm, phone, de teléfono, de llamar. De oh. fine, fine, found, ah, found, found, ok. Ya le voy a explicar sobre la pronunciación, but good. Y Beth en Carlos, que ya lo vi preocupado, uh, pobre Carlos. Ajá. Destroyed. Ah, destroyed. Uh -huh. Carlos Gabriel. Archiver. Ok, Gabriel, Oscar. Drunk. I'm sorry. Drunk. Uh -huh. Born. Born. Irregular. Irregular. Ajá. Con Pero T, dijiste. Born, born, drum, drum. Ok. Eh, ya lo está leyendo. Lo está... Ok, good. Thank you, Gabriel. Nice. <risa> eh, we go now with Oscar en carito. No, ninguna. Ninguna. Ok. Carito. And then Nina. Me quitaron el drum, voy a I'm decir sorry. driven. Ah, driven. driven, good, good, driven. Mm -hmm. Driven, driven. Thank okay. you, perfect. Uh, Nina and then Ellie. 
Fallen. Fallen, good. Ellie, and then Duran. Um, destroyed. Lo que había... destroyed. Copiando, Pensado. Ellie, copiando, copiando. Okay. Okay, Era Durán. única que tenía en la mente, me la ganaron. Así es la vida, nos ganan oh, muchas sí. cosas y personas. Duran en Wilfredo. Oh, dance it. Dance, good, ok. Creo que la dijeron. Ok, Wilfredo. Your last chance. Bye. What is that? ¿Qué es eso? Pay. Ah, pay, pay. Ok, pay. good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ok. En, 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 en síntesis. Normalmente en ED lo decimos con ID en la pronunciación o con D o con T. Por ejemplo, destroyed. Eso después lo vamos a ver porque no estamos viendo el pasado, solo para decirlo. Destroyed. La, este es con T. Dance. ¿Verdad? Con T, established. Después vamos a ver. Y este con I de hated. Hated. No vamos a decir accepted jamás. Se dice accepted. Accepted. Son cosas que vamos a ver un poquito más adelante. ¿Verdad? Y si no, en, en el otro módulo. En el caso de este, pues ya cambia, ¿verdad? Es drunk, drunk, don. Uh -huh. okay. Ya mucho verbo. Demasiado verbo. Let's go to action. Vámonos a la acción. ¿Ok? Um, entonces. Uh, por eso ya ven aquí rated, ya ven con ed, ¿verdad? Rated, recognized, son regulares, si se dan cuenta. ¿Ok? Tenemos la otra, por ejemplo, miren, known, tenemos known, ¿ok? ¿Ok? Recognized, rated, ¿ok? Ya son verbos en participio. Hoy sí ya captan que es un participio, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. ya, ya lo identificamos. ¿Ok? Listening, ups, 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 Ok, listening, I need you to. To be ready with your pencil. Van a escuchar una voz muy um, encantadora. Okay, let's leave. Life. There is a great deal of worry around us the entire day, which makes it part of our brain's obstacles. The pressure can emerge at the office, at home, in certain relations, or in whatever else. While taking care of these sorts of pressure, People don't find the opportunity to see the excellence of life. We overlook that there is something more in our life, which is significant and wonderful. God has given us a lot of beneficial things like the magnificence of nature in our life. Okay, listen one more time. Life. There is a great deal of worry around us the entire day which makes it part of our brain's obstacles. The pressure can emerge at the office, at home, in certain relations, or in whatever else. While taking care of these sorts of pressure, people don't find the opportunity to see the excellence of life. We overlook that there is something more in our life, which is significant and wonderful. God has given us a lot of beneficial things like the magnificence of nature in our life. Ok, después de haber escuchado esta voz tan encantadora, dulce y seductora, let's see what words have you identified, ok? And we start in this case with Ellie and then Edwin. Mm -hmm. One or two words that you remember? Eh, eh, sería life, advance, obstacle, at home, at the office, people, opportunities, magnificence, wonderful. Wow, a lot of good. Yo creo que le quitaste life a la mayoría. But nice. And Edwin, Excuse me. No problem. Edwin, and then we go with Steffi. Okay. Eh, taking care Magnificent, obstacle, office at home, something more. Good. Steffi and Claudia. 
life office obstacle opportunity. Good. Claudia Oscar. And life uh, wet office opportunity. Good. I give night. Thank you. Oscar and Carlos. Life band obstacle home health office. People, excellent place, significant, magnificent, thinker, wonderful, he never left. Okay, interesting. Thank you. Do we have some other words? ¿Alguien tiene más palabras que no las hayan mencionado? One or two words. I'm sorry. ¿Puedo decir las mías? Yes, please, go ahead. Okay. Lace, bands, work, obstacle. Give more people, excellent, other fun to see and not a lot. Mm -hmm. mm, very nice. Okay, thank you. So I guess you have identified a lot of words. You have written some of them. I have escuchado bastante. That, that's really good. Okay, uh, let's uh, listen one more time, but with uh, the, the written, the writing, sorry. Ya con la escritura acá. Será más fácil. Sigamos la lectura con la vista. Life. There is a great deal of worry around us the entire day, which makes it part of our brain's obstacles. The pressure can emerge at the office, at home, in certain relations, or in whatever else. While taking care of these sorts of pressure, people don't find the opportunity to see the excellence of life. We overlook that there is something more in our life, which is significant and wonderful. God has given us a lot of beneficial things like the magnificence of nature in our life. Okay. Um, here how uh, like a very deep, deep uh, speech of light, okay? So that's it, uh, very interesting words. God has given us a lot of beneficial things like magnificence of nature in our life. Dios nos ha dado, pues, muchas cosas beneficiosas como eh, la que tan magnífica, ¿verdad? De la magnificencia de la naturaleza en nuestra vida. Really interesting. Okay, uh, 9 and 33, it means 27 minutes, 27 minutos y terminamos la clase. Okay, that sounds really good. Suena bastante bien. We continue with this y después vamos a la pregunta de nuevo. Complete the statement using passive voice. ¿Cómo vamos a utilizar voz pasiva? Passive voice utilizando using the verbs in past participle. O sea, estos verbos que nosotros vemos acá. De todos estos, perdón. Y estos, right? Esos son los pas, eh, participle verbs, esos. Así que, easy. Si tienen dudas, pues, uh, les, les ayudo. Number one. Eh, Yvette, ¿puedes ayudarme eh, leyendo? Number one, our company. Our company is... Considered... Considered consider the best manufacturer of... Bronx is in the country. In the country, okay. So we have two, three, four, five, and six volunteers. Okay, teacher number two. Go. Mm -hmm. Our products rated as five of the most popular in the United States. Excellent. Solo falta algo. El verbo to be. ¿Qué sería? Right. Mm -hmm. Aquí utilizaríamos yeah. is o utilizaríamos oh. are. What do you think? Is yes. okay. yes. are porque somos are. nosotros los productos, ok. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Yes, the product. Si dijera uh -huh. our product sin la S, si sí vais, ok. Our products okay, are okay. rated. Entonces va a ir el verbo to be. Thank you, Luis. Really good. Okay. Uh, any other volunteers? Three, four, five, and six. Vamos bien. Eli y Carlos. Ok. Number one. Our vegetables. Our writer is the less contaminated of the national market. Yes. Our rated 
vegetables, vegetables, yes, our vegetables are ready as the less contaminated of the national market. Dice que lo, nuestros vegetales, nuestras verduras están eh, ubicadas, ¿verdad? Calificadas como las menos, least, least es menos, ¿verdad? En lo menos contaminada del mercado. Ok, good. Eh, Carlos, and then Carito. Ok, five teacher. The okay. company is now a, a more, ¿cómo es? Mago. Mayor, mayor. Mayor producer of shoes in the region. Ok. Known, con N, ¿verdad? Known, como en la conversación. Es known. La compañía es conocida. Ajá. Como la mayor productora de zapatos en la región. Ok, Carito, three or four. Ok, teacher. I have no idea. Hola. Junior. Diga tu corazón. Tú puedes. You can do it. Number three. Our customer service agents, agents. Our agents are perceived as mm -hmm. the most efficient in the sector. Perceived mm -hmm. as the most mm -hmm. efficient in the sector. Efficient okay, the really sector. good. Pinto, hello, Mr. Pinto. Can you help us with four? Thank you, Carito. Very well done. Let's Hello, try. Good evening. Good evening. Necesitamos el Good verbo to be y el sí en pasado participio. The brand is, is, is so. Ok, so es el pasado de sí. Pasado simple, pero necesitamos el verbo, el, el verbo en pasado participio. Uh -huh. We are, we are the. Eh, ajá. We, you have to add N at the end. N. Sí. So, sí. Casi. N. Sin. N. Uh -huh. sin. Yes. Can you read it, please? The brand is seen. The brand is seen as the leader of the energy drinks market. Perfect. Not nice. Okay. Entonces, para que vean que. Entonces, si se dan cuenta, uh, if you notice, we use verb and past participle verbs. Y esto se le llama voz pasiva. Escuchen bien. Nuestros productos están clasificados. Nuestro, eh, nuestros agentes de servicio al cliente eh, son percibidos. La marca es vista. La compañía es conocida. Entonces, el verbo tiene como énfasis no quién hace la acción, sino quién recibe la acción. La marca es vista como la líder en eh, bebidas de energética en el mercado de, 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 de bebidas energéticas la marca es vista quién la ve así los clientes pero no importa sino que importa es ok good vamos con lo último what's the name of this song carito ok 22 minutos 22 minutos el tiempo creo que va algo rápido este lunes me gusta i like it i like it carito ok uh, let me Scream, let me share screen. Can do it. Todos van a aprender a compartir pantalla. En el otro curso, si están conmigo, vamos a hacer algo un poco diferente con esta actividad. Really good. Vamos por pasos. I can share screen. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's my fault. It's my fault. Yes, I know. Hey, come on. <laughs> Qué mala. Okay. Esta es una colombiana, no va a poner. Ay, sí, cabal. Una rumba. Lo que me gusta es que se tiene aquí la guitarrita. I like it. Ok. okay. ¿Qué es esta can? ¿Qué es esta lata? Coke. What? Orange, orange juice. Cuba naranja. What is this? ¿Qué? ¿El qué? ¿El qué? ¿El qué? El qué? Ah, forget it. Forget it. Olvídalo. Vamos. Okay, you and me, we used to be together every day together, always. I really feel that I losing my best friend. I can't believe this could be the end. It looks a throw, a hope you're letting go and it is real. Well, I don't want to know. ¿Y la cantaba? ¿Tú dijiste que le ibas a cantar? Ah, pero es que nadie quiso cantar. 
But you can make the difference. Puede hacer la diferencia, Carito. Come on. Wait, esperemos a ver si alguien se la sabe. Si no, la, es que cantándola ya la van a adivinar. Ok. Come on. I know the name of this song. I like it. It's a really good one. I know. Yes. Me la dedicaron. Si no me equivoco, es una mujer la cantante. Yes, it is. And... No, no digo nada más, ya sé cuál es. Ok. Ya dio una pista. ¿no? Kenia said a club. Ajá, Eli. Ni idea. No idea. No idea. Ok. What about the others? No, the so others. Very, it's a very popular song. Yes. I don't know what year, but... I guess it's from the 90s, de los 90, creo que es. The 90s, yes. I guess, I guess it's from the 90s. Cuando era un chico inocente. De la, de la Britney Spears. <laughs> no. no. It's la another Britney. blonde girl. <laughs> it's an, it's yes, a, it's a blonde girl, but it's, a, it's not Britney. Uh -huh. Ajá. Britney, Britney. It's Britney. Okay. Yeah, rubia, pero no es la Britney. Yes. ¿Dónde está la, la Jessica, rubia? La Jessica, no sé cómo se llama. Jessica Simpson, no, no. sweetie. No. Ok. Ah, adivinar. Ok, carito. Ah, Kenia, said, said it. Dilo. Say it. Don't speak. Don't speak. Don't speak. Don't speak. Hasta, Wendy, Wendy, hasta Wendy, suspira, no. pobre Wendy. Yes. <laughs> Don't speak from No Doubt. That's the name of the group, right? The band, No ah, Doubt. No, you Gwen Stefani. It's Gwen Stefani. Don't tell me because it's hard. Relax, relax. Ah, ya ya está poniendo más Ya, ya okay. no van las lágrimas aquí. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. You and Los puse me. románticos. We used to be together. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> That's it. Yes, when Stephanie, I guess. Yes. No me yes, me Stephanie. Yes, a really nice voice. I like it. I like it a lot. When okay. Stephanie. Uh, <laughs> so that's the name of this song. Don't speak. Mm -hmm. From No Doubt. Thank you, Carito. Perfect. Okay. Now let's move with uh, the rest. Oh, I'm sorry. What is the most dangerous thing you have done? We're going to finish all with this. And I like to listen Ellie. Ellie Sabilha Kings Reyes. Uh, what is the most dangerous thing you have done? Handling a firearm without checking that it was unloaded and amazed a shot. Ok, yo was uploading, estaba subiendo algo sin revisarlo o what, what, eh, algo eh, manipulando un arma. What? Y eh, no la revisé que no tuviera el tiro de recámara y se me fue. And did you did you shoot, right? Disparaste and nobody got hurt. Nadie salió herido. No, 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 pero a la distancia que estabas y haberla acertado, me hubiera llevado a mi primo y a mi hermana. Ay, Eli, eso te pasa por andar Travies travie traveseando. Yes, uh -huh. yes, shoot, shoot, como una canción de Bob Marley que se llama I Shot the Sheriff, pero el pasado de shoot es shot, disparé, como un shot de tequila, ok? And so that's it, shoot is the verb. El pasado es shot. Okay, thank you, Elisa. So dangerous. That's, I guess, that's the most dangerous thing that we have heard. Ya me da miedo estar con él. Es lo más, lo más peligroso que hemos escuchado tonight. Sí. Oh. Ya no lo voy a saludar en la empresa, mejor. Okay. Ay, qué ingrata. Okay. Al contrario, me tiene que saludar más. Ok. Le tendré, le diré a los vigilantes que tengan más. Ah, que, que, que la revisen. Ok. Eh, Nina. What about you, Nina? And after Nina, we go with Steffi. Okay, I'm trying to explain. Yes, try, come on. When I make a trip to India. Ah, okay. And when I walk to the street, uh, my friends look at the 
cobra, the snake. Ah, snake. And then say, Nina, stop. And say, why? The cobra look at you. If you look at the, the cobra, I, I don't remember, hypnotized? Hip hypnotized, you are hypnotized. Hypnotized, and then maybe uh, te pica. No sé, yes. me va a picar. Yes, the, the, the snake can bite you. Puede morderte. Uh -huh, yeah, can bite you, yes. Wow. And then, and then it stop, and my friends run away, and the snake run away too. In this moment, I come back in the other street for myself. Wow. So everybody was running, disappearing. Yeah. Yeah. Se fueron. <laughs> yeah. Sí. Como dicen, ajá, se fueron ahí espantados. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. A cobra cae. No, no, no. A cobra, <laughs> a snake. Wow. And yeah. I, well, there are some people who they, they get dizzy, se marean o se desmayan when they see a, a snake. Yeah. But in yes. your case, you, you were like a very, you were like a statue, como una estatua, okay? Frozen, yes, yes. Don't, don't move, don't okay. move, don't move any. Frozen. Yeah. And fortunately, you didn't look into snake's eyes, right? No viste los ojos de la serpiente. Okay. Wow. No. Well, yeah. I guess that's really, really dangerous. Nina, ya no vayas allá. No, no, no. Don't no. go over there. <laughs> no. Okay. Thank okay. you, Nina. Really okay. interesting. Interesting. A mí un perro me ha seguido, but that's another story. Okay. <laughs> We go with uh, who is next? Steffi, creo que dije, right? Steffi and then Duran. Teacher, pero yo no tengo ninguna porque nunca he estado así como que en una situación peligrosa. Amar es peligroso. Okay. Sí, pero yo no amo. Ok. Ok. Oh, mi teacher. Eh, okay. Este es peligroso porque odia. No yes, amo. that's dangerous. That's really dangerous. No, no es un sentimiento neutro ni amo okay. ni odio. Ok, relax, relax. Después viene la terapia, ¿verdad, Carito? Hacemos grupos de terapia aquí. Ok. Eh, Durán. Durán, and then we go with Gabriel. Ok, Durán, please. Oh, I was on a motorcycle and my friend who has driving, uh, there were bad words at the police and the fault was up. We hid in the shirt. You hit? Yeah, we. Okay, hit. you hit to what? A, a que le pegaron? A que chocaron? No, on the police. The police? Ah, with the, the police, police officer. Yeah. And well, how was the, the, the fine? La multa, fine. Cuando dicen, I am fine, estoy bien, pero fine, también significa multa. Did you have fine? Did you go to jail? Or what happened? ¿Qué pasó? No, no problem. No, no problem. Wow. Bueno, creo que tuvieron mucha suerte. You were, uh, you were really lucky. Thank you, Gabriel. Interesting. With motorcycles, I kind of dangerous. Okay. Yes. So, uh, Gabriel, you go, and then we go with Yvette. Okay, but had I done danger? I did the most danger during I even then stands his swim bare handed cross in the trail of approximately 75 meter round trip. Okay, you swam, nadaste. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. seven to five meters. Seven to five meters. Metros, metros, nadando. Sí, profundo, sí, brazo limpio. Ah, deep, profundo, wow. Sí. Yes, kind of dangerous. I could, I, I, I guess uh -huh. I, I can't do it. I wouldn't do it, yo no lo haría. my wife, so, so did my wife. Uh, no so solo yo. Ah, no solo yo. only myself, uh -huh. myself. Oh, wow. Sorry. Wow, mm -hmm. it's kind of difficult. Okay, nice, Gabriel. We have, you have your abilities. Thank you, Yvette and Carlos. Uh, okay. Um, the most dangerous 
thing you have done uh, the night uh, the serpent when he asked me with a knife in with a his knife hand. Con cuchillo. It was a thief or uh, ladrón? Correct. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. It was at night. At night. Um, no. During the fue, day. Fue en el día, sí, correcto. Wow. Yo and, iba manejando, estaba haciendo un alto en... Uh, in en the semaphore, in the traffic light. So that happens. And did, did he hurt you? ¿Te lastimó? Or just take the thing. Mm, Solo tomo las cosas. Pues, gracias a Dios, no me lastimó y tampoco le di nada, pero después reaccioné. <laughs> yes. The reaction sí. of every person is different. Some, mm -hmm. some react different or some other get in shock. Okay. So, well, fortunately, fortunately, nothing happened, but we have to be, we, ha we have to be mm -hmm. always watching. Okay. That's sí, really correcto, dangerous. Sí. In Salvador, it's kind of, okay. So yes. difficult. Thank you. If it, and Carlos and Wilfred and we finished. Okay. Okay, teacher. The most danger this is when I dot crouching me one me one and curvy. I make motor city by sitting we city wide. I eat eat my chest on the side of what. Okay. So you were you were driving or a friend? Tu ibas manejando un amigo. Sí, no, yo. Okay. So well. Uh, how much time do you have uh, riding a motorcycle? ¿Cuánto tiempo tienes de, de manejar motocicleta? Uh, five years. Okay, five years is kind of well. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Wilfredo and Pinto, and we finished, right? Okay, Wilfredo, are you ready? Uh, the most dangerous thing I've ever done uh, have an accident on public transport to bank drone. Oh, wow. Traffic accidents. And what did you get hurt? ¿Qué te lastimaste? The leg, la pierna, arm, el brazo, or no? No, no. Hurt. Yo iba conduciendo. <laughs> Me caí en todo encima. Okay. In, in a motorcycle? No. No, no. Car? It's Okay. Uh, transport the public. Ah, in public transportation, the bus crash. Yes. Crash significa chocar, crash. Y toda la gente te cayó encima. Okay. Yes. Que te hicieron buruca. Okay. So, something that happens sometimes in the public transportation. And what about Pinto? Do you have your answer, Pinto? Yes, it's your... Please, go. Uh, the, the most dangerous things... Uh, I have done is one day um, I'm going in my car. I, I was driving and, and I be late and, and I see um, a bus um, and before uh, a truck. And, and I see the distance is, is, is too, too longer. And when I see the, the, the right street free, um, I, I say, um, I can do it. I, and I gonna I gonna take the speed and, and let behind the, these two cars. And when I realized, teacher, the distance uh, was too short. short. This too short. And yes, and, uh, when I the I hit I hit the brakes hard, bruscamente. Yes. And I I I could I could cause an accident. Oh yes. A big crash. So so that was not an accident because you could you could you hold could, the, the brake. You could Mr. hold the Frenat. brake. Wow. Yeah. Yes, that depends on your reflex, depend on your reflexes and all those things. Yes. Right? Well, well, thank you, Pinto. Yes, kind of that was good because no accidents, but we have to take care a lot. Okay, okay. my friends. Nice. Voy a explicarles esto porque eh, Los ejercicios son de vo la voz pasiva en la plataforma que espero que los estén terminando. Ok, aquí tenemos. Eh, this is the structure, esta es la estructura. Sujeto, verbo, objeto. Sencillo, 
tenemos. Eh, aquí es normal. Él abre la puerta. Esa es una oración normal, pero la oración pasiva cambia. Miren, the door is open. La puerta está abierta. No es necesario ponerle by him. Es lo que le digo, que quien hace la acción aquí no tiene relevancia. It's not so important. What it matters is the verb and the object. Lo que importa es el verbo acá y el objeto. ¿Ven? Él abre la puerta. Esa es la oración normal. Pero en la, en la voz pasiva cambia. La puerta está abierta. ¿Verdad? Y así decimos, ok. Por ejemplo, ah, la refrigeradora está abierta. El carro está encendido. ¿Quién lo hizo? It is not like a matter. No es tanto importante, sino que es lo que sucede, ¿verdad? Eh, el chorro está abierto. Ok, yeah, anda a cerrarlo. So, that's passive voice. Esa voz pasiva. Nosotros utilizamos voz pasiva en español. Ok, so that's it. Now, eh, ya que tenemos claro esto, solo no, nos quedan como tres minutos. Ok, vamos a cambiarlo. Vamos a reescribir. Look, he opens the door. Él abre la puerta. The door is open. Pueden escribirle by him, por él, o si no, the door is open. Ok. Um, at least terminamos dos oraciones por lo menos, o tres. Ok. So, check here. Maybe we can, tal vez podemos cambiarla porque acá tenemos esto. Quiero ver. Ya. Yeah. Tratemos de hacer una de estas y una de las otras para que mañana continuemos. Uh -huh. Ok. Si quieren que se estén un poquito avanzaditas, vámonos. I'm sorry. I don't know what is going on with this computer. Ok. Este es más fácil porque aquí solo tenemos que ordenar las palabras y agregarle el verbo to be. Tenemos acá, por ejemplo, la primera, the room is swept twice a day. El Peace. El, el cuarto es, digamos, trapeado dos veces al día. Uh -huh. Entonces solo le vamos a agregar el is. ¿okay? Y cambiamos el verbo. Vamos a intentar acá. Ok, Kenia, any idea? Luis, any idea? Yo le voy a ayudar. Ok, Jeff. Uh -huh. Sería tú. The shop is open. Mm -hmm. Open. Open. Uh -huh. Open before eight o'clock. Yes. Thank you. Perfect. Uh, this shop. Esta tienda está abierta antes de las ocho. Okay, Carito and Luis. Okay, Carito. Ok, number three. Nice cars are produced in Germany. And Luis, the last one. Ok, teacher number five. Some animals are. I use the verb over the kill. Kill. Kills. Aquí sería killed. Mm -hmm. In jungles. Okay. Jungles, como la canción de Gansel Rose, welcome mm -hmm. to the jungle, jungle. Okay, okay. okay that's it. Mm -hmm. Carlos. Okay, night teacher. Okay, nine. Mo mobile, mobile phone are phone. Mm -hmm. uh, produced in China. Thank you. Ya vieron que está fácil. Vamos a continuar mañana, ¿ok? Can you see? No están tan difíciles, ¿verdad? Están algo prácticas. ¿Ok? I'm going to check the attendance list. Y seguimos con estos ejercicios. We're going to continue tomorrow with these exercises. Please say hello if you listen your name. Eh, Alfredo Saldaña, no. Carlos Ramírez, no. Carlos Abrego. Present. Thank you. Pinto. Eh, Carito. Present, teacher. Present. Ok. Edwin. Present, Present teacher. teacher. Thank night. you, Carito. Thank you, Edwin. Elisa. Present teacher. Okay. Um, Carito, tonight is your 10 minute session, okay? Okay. Um, Steffi. Mm -hmm. 
Present. Eh, Gabriel. Durán. Present teacher. Yvette. Ok. Kenia. Present teacher. Good. Luis. Present teacher. Nice. Present teacher. Oscar. Nice. Ina. Present teacher. Wilfredo. Claudia. Present teacher. Gwen. Present here, teacher. Ok. Present teacher. Ok, my friends. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Solo se queda carito. Bye. -bye. Good night, people. Okay. Carito, um, tell me, what do you prefer? ¿Te ve el cabello más liso, Carito? ¿Se te ve más brillante? Really good. Me, 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 me planché, teacher. Okay. Okay, lo tengo horrible. Really? I don't think so. No, te creo. Ok. Eh, Carito, do you want a review? ¿Quieres una revisión de algún tema anterior? ¿O do you want another interview? Depends on you. Interview is ok. Mm -hmm. Ok. Just give me a second. Sí. Ok. <coughs> Here I have some other, th these are like different questions. Okay. Can you tell me about your best friend? Anything, anything, what, whatever. Maybe. In this moment, I don't have a best friend, you know? Mm, okay. Uh, I I don't have social life. I don't know. But maybe I can talk about Kenya. It's mm -hmm. the most, I don't know, cercana. Um, yes, close. Mm -hmm. It's close. like close to you. Okay. Okay. It's the most close people I have. She's really nice. She's a very good person. Yeah. Um, She's very uh, worked people. She's nice, nice. Uh, I don't know what else to say. She's okay. very intelligent. Yes, I can notice that. Okay. Um, can you mention one or two uh, of your best moments in your life? One or two, depends. One of, uh, you can say the best moments or it, it can it can be like a happy moment, a crazy moment. I always had in my mind my graduated of college day. I don't know why, but I really like that day. What's perfect from the beginning to the really end? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I I get a beautiful dress. It, it, I was with all my family, was a family uh, dinner, friends, party. I don't know what's really everything really nice. was excellent. Like in yeah. order, no, no, no problems with anything. Okay. Yes. Yes. What's the pretty day actually? I don't know why I always remember that moment. And the other when my daughter was born, uh, apartando el dolor horrible, espantoso. Yes. De la... <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> besides, besides when, that. Yeah, when I, when I saw his eyes, his small eyes and disposition was. Uh -huh. and the baby face, uh -huh. right? The baby, like a doll, como una muñequita, like a doll, like yes, this, like and, moving. And his eyes, small eyes, looking me and mordiéndose las manos biting 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 the, the coach the, mm -hmm. yeah that wow moments. yes uh, besides the the pain aparte del dolor mm -hmm. i guess that is like one of the, the best mm -hmm. moments that happy moment and it is difficult to describe right it's not easy to describe yeah. you just live and talking about your graduation day it is really good because sometimes in those uh events sometimes we have difficulties 
different aspects. But if you, if that was like one perfect day, wow. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. The morning to the. To the end. <laughs> okay. Yes. Wow. <laughs> I can imagine. Okay. And let me see. Well, interesting. Now tell me. Uh, what family occasions do you celebrate in your family? How? I mean, is are there some celebration, special days during the, the year uh, or special events in your family that you celebrate? If we are talking about Colombia, all mm -hmm. the holidays. Um, uh -huh. Start with um, San Valentin. Some the Valentine's, Mother's Day, the Sunday, the Sunday, the Father's Day, uh, of course, Christmas, uh, New Year, uh, the birthday of or the family always is a cake. But here in El Salvador, I lost the tradition. Just birthday, but I don't know how to say is that. For me, it's, it's not kind of simple. Important. It's like yes. simple. Mm -hmm. I don't. It's I, not a big deal. I not don't feel cosa. the big emotion like before. Like in the I past don't... or like in Colombia. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, you, you were like excited and, and I don't know, with that emotion to do the things. Yes. It happens. It happens. I and family that. traditions, uh, family traditions are like the most uh, beautiful events that you can have. But I understand you, okay. Yeah. Um, what do you like? Uh, what do you like uh, most about, or in the past, what did you like most about your school or high school or at university? Something that you remember that was really good to you? The place, people, teachers, uh, classmates. No. Nothing. No, you didn't <laughs> like. Nunca, no te gustó. Uh, the breaks on on the sec elementary school, I guess the food, the environmental in the college, I don't know. Oh, okay. Was a lot of pressure. Mm -hmm. Okay. I guess. That's okay. Cool. You didn't enjoy too much school time, right? No. Okay. In in college, the <laughs> the parties of the weekend. Oh, really? Really the, good parties. The, yes. It was Lord, what were they very common? Uh, yes. And in engineer, there was a lot of parties every weekend. That was really nice, actually. Okay, interesting. I I can imagine that you are like a party girl, having fun in the past, having fun, enjoying, and now you okay. need that. Dance. You... I love it. I love dance. Uh, uh, now I don't do that, but in the college, yeah. You should, Friday, Carito. Saturday, Sunday night. Monday, lunes festivo, how do you say? Mm -hmm. Yes, like a happy Monday or yes, festivity Monday. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Carito, you should, you have to get out or liberate that mm -hmm. energy, stress, energy, tense, okay? Because you are a very uh, enthusiastic or you are like extrovert person you are like that they're extrovertida so that's why you you have more energy and you have to focus that in some activities okay yes but you should i i have to to make space to go to dance i promise yes you should. maybe you maybe for my birthday i expect to go to dance in july ah, I really? yes yes it's necessary Okay. I'm going to play. Yes. And you're going to, to be 39 
41. 43. 43. Ah, you're young. You're really young. Come on. You are in your best. Dile eso time. a mi cuerpo, teacher. Come on. <laughs> Good food. Uh, what? To, have, to eat uh, a lot of fruits. Okay. It is necessary. Okay. Uh, Carito, fíjate que te estaba haciendo preguntas random. Que tengo por acá. Y si las contestas bien. Que manejas muy bien el pasado. Eh, sí, hay ciertas cositas, ¿verdad? Algunos verbos. Pero el futuro es fácil para ti. Siento que no, no te cuesta. El presente también. Das detalles. Das supporting details. Que son... Yes, es, I know. Ajá. Entonces estás hablando de algo y das detalles. Vas agregando. Entonces de eso se trata. ¿Verdad? Como que esté contando algo. El pasado, eh, lo que pasa es que poco a poco eh, van a... Se van a, a cubrir esos temas, pero estás bastante bien, Carito. Eh, you, no sé qué tanto le dedicas, si le dedicas un poquito más al inglés, pero sí te noto una gran diferencia en comparación del qué, de la primera semana que estuvimos en el curso anterior. I, I can see that you are advancing, estás avanzando, and I like it. To be honest, I don't have time too much time. To... No, I am. I'm a really busy person, actually. These days, I have been listened and seen videos of music the 90s, uh, trying oh. to, to learn more vocabulary and the listening. Me cuesta muchísimo yeah. listening. Sí, pero vas, vas bastante I'm trying, bien. I'm trying. Yeah. I... I would like to have more time to review, but I don't have time, really. Yes, I'm sorry. I can imagine. You are a really busy woman. Yes. For example, the, this, this weekend on Saturday, I was all day since 7, 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. in the college with my daughter in the wow. Faith Day. Es que se dice de día deportivo, Faith Day. Yes. Mm -hmm. Faith Day. Yes. Mm, okay. Oh. You have like a very busy days, but come on, you have the ability. Tienes la habilidad, solo te, hay que nutrirla más. Okay, Carito. Yeah, I know, I know I have, I need a lot of vocabulary in the past, so, so, mm -hmm. but I'm going to learn with you a lot. Little by little, poco a poco, little by little. Pero me alegra que estén de, estén de nuevo y que tú estás en el, en el grupo, pues sí. Espero enseñarles aún más, ¿ok? Y motivarlos. Sí, súper. Eso hablábamos, que es que chévere que nos tocó con usted y Carlita, la que estaba con nosotros, porque le escribí que no la vi, le, ¿qué le pasó? Pensé que se había salido. No, ya estaba, ya quería estar con nosotros y le dije, estábamos con el teacher Josué. Le salió la lágrima, pues, porque quería estar con, con usted también, seguir con el curso, porque uno hace como, sí, como que hace... chévere el, el team. Sí, el equipo está así, así como que genial y, y esa buena vibración es la que debemos de llevar, pues, ¿verdad? Esa buena energía y disposición, ¿verdad? Espero que también eh, aprenda mucho Carlita con, con otros teachers, ojalá, pero sí se la extraña, se la extraña, ¿verdad? Así que me la saludas, así que estamos terminando, Carito, ¿verdad? Okay, como teacher, siempre me paso con vos, me... es un gusto, como siempre, ¿verdad? Así que ánimo. See you tomorrow, ok. See you tomorrow, ok. Puértate bien y mal, ok. Siempre, siempre. <risa> Feliz noche. Bye bye. Adiós.